Hello YouTubers, today I'll be showing you how to install ICS on Xperia Pro. At first we have to turn our cell phone off and then take off the back cover and take out the battery and take out your SIM card and memory card. It's best that you back up your apps or the data you have. After taking out the SIM card and the memory card, you just put back on the battery and turn the power on. After that, we'll go to the menu at first and then to settings. And then we'll go to developer option, I guess. As far as I can remember, yes it's it's the developers option that's we're gonna go and then allow USB debugging yes and after doing that we need to download a couple of files basically two which we will be needing to flash the OS so here you can see two links on my sticky notes the blue sticky note so the first link is for the flash tool now this is the tool that will help you to flash your device and do everything, you know, unlock the bootloader and every other thing, root your device. So you go to the, that side and download the flash tool. After downloading, yeah, so after downloading it, you will need the ICS. So it's the first link on the sticky note so yes this is where you can get the ICS so you'll download it after downloading it what you have to do is extract the full file after extracting you'll get one file so you'll copy that file and then go to the directory where the flash tool is installed and paste it in the firmware folder so you can see that already there's one that is extends ICS so you will test paste your I ICS basically nothing else and after that what I have to do is you see that it's connected you connect the USB cable and yeah cancel all this Sony com companion or whatever that they call it cancel all the stuff and then open the flash tool after opening the flash tool it will get all the infos like your which version of OS it's using so my one's already updated to ICS so your my your one might say you will say gingerbread 2.3.7 or whatever it is that you're running and then you have to click on the the thunder icon and choose the first option that is flash mode and then you have this option the the directory would go to go back to the flash tool and then all these other files other the writings are so you have to just click on the first two uh, things on the right side and nothing else then it will work on itself and then you will see this pop-up window so now you have to turn off your cell phone at first and then press the back button and then put the cable uh, connect the cable data cable so that it goes in the flash boot mode and on the on the side you'll see the blue light flashing so it means that you are connected properly to the flash boot mode that's it that's pretty much it so you're gonna that's pretty much it thanks for watching my video rate subscribe and i'll do a review video also on the ics thanks peace out